Wrong gun. I heard a wolf growl. Oh, I can hear it again. I'm going to try and get a bit of open ground here. Because I can't see him. What is that there? Oh, that's a couple of bison. Is it a big one? I do have wolf coming in. Maybe they're not coming. That's a three easy. Oh, we've got another one down there. Where are the wolf? I have to pop the scope off this. Oh, here we are. Hello. Hello, boy. Let's change the gun 25 meters and we'll put a hole in there. Come and get it. Alright, that'll teach you. Oh, they scared the bison off, dude. I'll probably put two boards in it. That's worry. The bison will, bison will probably settle down. Let's pick the wolf up. You're a chicken little wolf. Alright, yeah, no, no integrity on that one. And that first shot. Damn, that was a bad one. I just accept it. It was a six hard, so we haven't really lost anything. And we have a bison running across in front of us. There he is. She. Uh, probably should put this gun on 150 now. Oh, we've got one charging me. What's going on? We've got another one over there. Look at you. Where are you? Oh, they're beyond them trees. Oh, more wolf. Look. That is excellent. There's a wolf right there. I think we hit that. Lag spike. Don't crash, guy. Have they gotten further away? Or well, one's down. I hit that one. Hit that one. So we've got a boss and a couple of wolf that are hit. Now you're allowed to use this rifle on it? I'm just not sure how many times you're allowed to hit them with it. I'm thinking let's pump them until they're dead. That's what I'm thinking. It's been a while since I've been in the Yukon. I haven't seen a wolf, you know, in a while. And I'm pretty desperate to shoot a few. <laughs> oh man, let's wander over. So it was done. Now, we have hit the bison. I'm pretty sure of that. Which is, this should be its tracks here, I think. Or a bit across. Oh, we got, oh, we got a lot of blood right there. That's beautiful. So that'll be dead. Right there, we'll just track it so we can come back later. Right, let's look ahead. What have we got? What have we got? Apart from the odd dead wolf that should be here. Now that, maybe that single wolf was from this pack. I don't know. It's good to see him out here, wolf and bison. Two of my favourite animals. I'm pretty sure I just saw a wolf run then. So there's one down. Like, once again, I don't mind if they come over and attack me. We'll pull out the rhino in case they decide to do that. And I'll put the rhino on 25. For a very nice close-up shot in the face or what have you. Alright. There's one wolf. Do we have more? I'm pretty sure we hit two to three of these things. Yeah, I can see two down. Three down. All right. So we've done all right here. Hit when the stomach. No quick kill. Not a problem. There's a blood on this one. Uh, we hit you in the backhand. 79% quick kill. At 252. So we're shooting... At a pretty far distance, really. 
Is there a third one? Will there be a fourth one? Oh, we hit you on the stomach. You're a male. 1245 bucks. I love that with the wolves. The money you get. It's fantastic. Now, we're just going to double check for any blood. Yes, yeah, see? Right here. We've got a blood. I'll check it out. Then we're going to... Oh, bison. Man, it is hopping around here today. I've got to say that. It is brilliant. Let's have a look. Oh, that's the one at the front. It's coming. I think that's our free very easy, which is now down. Alright, so we've got that down. We've got a wolf here. Man, it's awesome today. Right on the cusp of the weekend on a Friday here for me in Melbourne. I hope it's more than just sort of injured like that. And not my luck, it's run up and down and up and down. Uh, I'm going to pick up the bison over here. Then I'm going to check for the other nails. We have one wolf, one bison, maybe two bison. I'm pretty sure this big bugger went down. It was running towards us. There it is. It should be the three easy maybe we saw earlier, the big male. So hopefully it is. It looked like it. But this was the first one I hit. And it is. That's a two minor. We hit it three times, man. That's a big hairy thing, isn't it? Wow, 82% quick kill, 50% integrity, and it's only a two minor. It looks huge. Unbelievable. Oh man, check it out over here. Oh, that's another two minor. It looks huge. So I've got bison all around me. I've got a wolf that's shot. I might have another two bison that are hit. There goes one there running. Just went up over that crest. So they're smelling me back that way. Now, is this the wolf? No, that's a bison. No, I'm not... I just want to see if this wolf has gone down a bit. It was around here where we first saw the blood. There it is. Bang. No organs hit. That's when it went down, and I'm pretty sure it came back up. Let's go over and check these bison. I might put a waypoint right here. So right on that track there, we'll place a waypoint. That's our wolf. And look at that. That's a three very easy fling. So that three easy is still around. Amazingly enough. And we have an injured wolf. Which is on the run. I've got another stack of bison over here. Oh, they moved now. That's the problem with this undergrowth. Once you get in it, like it looks pretty clear. <laughs> once you get in it, it's a bit thick. There we are. There's that two minor. So he's just having a graze. Now, as you know, if you're a regular here, I've been trying to bust these bison open to put bigger ones on my map. Like, I do have a run of a lot of the same um, scores in a herd. And I'm trying to break that up. Like, who wouldn't? Why wouldn't you try and break that up? And just put bigger animals on your map. Right, let's have a look now. They're in a drinking zone. Two minor. Oh, one must have smelt me. Yeah, the wind's changed. And they're off. Uh, I'm going to go back, concentrate on the ones we've hit. And we'll catch up with these fellas a bit later. Because I'm pretty sure they'll come back to the area. They won't be too far away. Damn yours! You can see the bison are back there. They're three easy. There. What are you? Two minor. One trivial. At least the, there's another three easy. At least they're actually getting better. Like at one stage there, every bison of mine was exactly the same size. It was a... Uh, Say a two minor, that'd all be a two minor. And it was like, what the hell is going on, mate? 
It seems like we're starting to break them up. Now, I do have that. I can't forget. I do have one over here that we hit really well. So I'm going to check that one out first. Pick up its body. It's got to be dead. The wolf now it went down the north to 25. We didn't hit an organ. And then it just stopped bleeding. So I got their tracks running up. Uh, as you can see, that was the wolf. <laughs> and it's just stopped bleeding. So we're going to check out this other bison that we hit. And it looked like we hit it in the lung. And see if we can pick it up. Alright, here's our bison. It's just up here laying down. Having a dirt nap. Poor thing. No. It didn't get far from the original hit. So I'd say we hit it in the lung. I don't know if we got double lung. What did we get? No, just the one lung. We did hit it twice. 100% though on everything. That lung shot pretty much killed it. Even though it was only 95, but we didn't get both lungs, unfortunately. But we get $896. So see that one there? That's a 3 easy. I'm going to put the gun on 300. We're going to use the 30 or 6 and try and go for an upper neck to head shot. Oh man, we got it in. Look at that. Instant death. That's with the 3006. Soft point bullet. Wow, let's go check that out. That is awesome. Okay, got another three easy there. I'm going to try the same thing. Oh man, look at that. 3006 again. Hey. Nothing running towards me. They're down, baby. Let's pick up the first one, which should be just over here. Wow, we Vicious man. They must be both brain shots. You gotta love that. Let's reload. Uh, as you can see, I'm just going for the bigger ones today. I'm not going Helter Skelter. Like, I do like going Helter Skelter at them and just, you know, going a bit berserk and popping them all. Uh, where was our first one, man? Should be around here. How can you miss a bison? Laying there dead. What's going on? Now, the others are still hanging around there a bit. They're not really running away too fast. Alright, there is... We have two bison down. Oh, here. Is that one there? Alright, there's one. We found one. Let's go get this one. And we'll check where we hit it. I'm saying probably a brain shot. Was that a good distance? I think it was a bit over 200. Let's have a look. And it should be gold, maybe? Free, easy. 100% on everything. And we did hit the brain. It's silver, unfortunately, not a gold. And it was a 262, and we did hit that brain with the soft point bullet. So we got the penetration at 262 with the 30 aught 6 with a soft point bullet and get $994. Bloody brilliant. Okay, we have found the second one. Oh, so his friends are just up here. Let's pick him up. All right, so this will probably be a silver also. And this lake is popping. I'm going to show you the map after we pick this up. Alright, it is the silver, 100% on everything, another three very easy. Male, 818 kilograms. And another brain shot, look at that. And that was like a side shot, like we weren't flush on there. It was a bit coming through the side. Just above that horn there, and we still got it. Still got the brain. I love the angle of the bullet. That's awesome. And this one's $1,012. So yeah, at least my bison is starting to get a bit bigger. I've got to keep coming here and, and belting into them. So this happens. So hopefully next time, these two that are free very easy we shot today, uh, be come back as four would be awesome. There's a nice looking bison. A furry. Dude. That looks pretty big. Two minor, man. It looks pretty huge. I suppose I've been in Hirschfelden for a while and I get used to the size of them bison. And of course they're not this big, are they? If you know what I mean. Uh, give me a look at your head again, sunshine. There we go. <laughs> Seriously. How's that for a rotten shot? They're still all around, they're over there now. Oh, I think that is, that, is that one walking there? 
Let's check the blood. What's going on? I smacked you in the head, didn't I? Uh, got tracks going everywhere. Where's the blood? A big bugger. Okay, we have a dead bison down here. I don't know if it's one that killed me or not. I was just one. Oh, look at that moose. Where'd it go? It went over the ridge. It looks okay. I don't get many big male moose on this map. Alright, after I pick this up, I'm going to show you exactly where we are. I kept going to do that. Alright, you're the one we hit with the 45. Okay, so you did die. Beautiful. Alright, let's check the map. So where we are. Alright, uh, I popped in here, which is Timbergold Trails, Trailhead, and just walked down to this lake. Now, there are a few lakes here. There's one there, one there, see, Copper Rock. But if you go to this outpost, Timbergold Trailhead, and just walk down, this is where all this action is today. Look, it's the moose. It's not real big, actually. It looked bigger <laughs> when I saw it out the corner of my eye. And we've got the heart shot in with the rhino. It's a beautiful shot on a moose. As we saw the other day, using the soft point bullets with the 300 on them, they're tough to, to penetrate at a distance on these things. Even when they're facing dead side onto you and you're going for the lungs. And then I was going, went for a few heart shots on a couple of them. I didn't get the penetration. But the rhino, not a problem there. We get a silver harps on everything. We hit the heart, right lung, and stomach. So as you can see, with the rhino, it just doesn't hit the heart. It, that keeps travelling. Like, it was only at 48 metres. Look at that. Hit the heart, right lung, and went into the stomach. This thing, no chance at all. And we get $1,020. Well, there we go. Just a quick hunt today at the Yukon. I will be back over the weekend. I hope to get a couple of more videos out. In my spare time, I have been watching a bit more Netflix. I watched John Wick 1 and 2. Now, I must be on a Keanu Reeves <laughs> sort of thing this week. We watched The Matrix, all three. Then John Wick 1 and 2. Both all good movies. Although that John Wick one, wow, that is that number two. That is super violent. They thought the Joker was violent. I got nothing on John Wick 2, let me tell you. <laughs> awesome film, though. I enjoyed it. And I've been playing um, GTA a little bit online. I'm actually still I've going back and doing the whole single player campaign again I've only done it the once so I've been doing that little bits and pieces of it over the last few weeks and really enjoying it we had Trevor following a plane that was going down last night on a dirt bike it was fantastic following this plane I'm really enjoying that game and I can't wait for Red Dead Redemption 2 I know that'll be out next month uh, it's on my wish list I want to get it I might even pre-purchase it the only other game I've ever ever pre-purchase with GTA 5 and they gave me some extra crap with that for doing that so apparently going to get extra stuff with uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 I'm just going to see what it is to make sure it, is it worth it to pre-purchase this thing before it comes out but we know it's going to be a good game so there's no doubt there we know it's going to be a good game just depends on what you get with it for doing that so we will find out anyway guys hope you enjoyed that I will be back over the weekend, hopefully with another couple of videos. So stay tuned. Thanks for dropping by, and I'll catch you on the next one. Thank you.